Hey guys, Ben here, and welcome back to another video on the DC TV crossover for this year, so the Elseworlds crossover. Today we're going to be talking about our first look at Arkham Asylum and Batwoman on set in this crossover. So if you do go on to enjoy the video, please be sure to leave a like and a comment. And subscribe if you're new so you don't miss any DC TV videos later this year. So Ruby Rose is finally properly on set. She's ready to film. They've only got a week left of filming. So take that as you will. She's only been on the set a few times prior to this week. So maybe she won't have as big of a role that they have actually been advertising. Maybe it's just like the back half of the crossover. And then she is a big part of those last few episodes or something like that. But anyway, let's break down these photos photos and so these are all coming from the sets and you can see the first photo posted by Melissa Benoist with Melissa and Ruby on set as Batwoman and Supergirl. I have to say Batwoman looks amazing. I think the suit really really works. It's very comic book accurate and it's very practical and I love the hair and the mask especially. Also the bat symbol and just the texture and the detail in the costume is really nice. It seems to be a bit more like the Supergirl material so it's a bit less fabric-y than say the past suits of the CW. So really nice suit but let's talk about the background. So in the background you can see the gates and that is in fact a hospital in Vancouver and also earlier today along with these photos that I've been posting with James Bamford and Ruby Rose as Batwoman There was that and then also Mark Guggenheim posted a photo of a cell in Arkham So he officially confirmed they are doing Arkham We presumed it and this is most likely where they're filming it behind Melissa and Ruby as you can see It is a Vancouver hospital. It has the gates seems very Arkham like and also Stephen Amell posted a picture of him and Grant in what looks like Arkham Asylum and also he's done a few little posts here and there with what looks like some sort of surgery table with blood all over it and yeah so essentially that's our first look at Arkham Asylum that's going to be a big part of at least the back part of the crossover and most likely this is to do with the sort of Doctor Destiny part of the crossover because that was the major rumour going into the crossover that Doctor Destiny was going to be one of the main villains and perhaps everything we've seen so far is part of his mastermind plan that maybe he has changed reality maybe similar to past crossovers I don't really entirely know what's going on overall because there's so many different things like the 90s flashes around he's been on set recently they've been shooting that Grant and Steven switch costumes they did other versions of themselves so most likely they are from different earths but it could overall be something to do with Dr. Destiny controlling and making them feel like they are someone else and maybe they actually become someone else that would be very in fashion with Arrow. You know, there's so many theories that we can talk about, but for now, we know that Batwoman's going to be in the crossover, at least the back part of it. We know there's Arkham Asylum. We've had our first looks at both of these things. Really excited for Arkham and also really excited for Batwoman. I can't wait to see what they bring. I love this comic book accurate costume and Ruby looks great as Batwoman. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys later. Goodbye. Shut free.